Hi, this is Shirley from Shirley's World, and this is a uh, YouTube video for eBay. Uh, yesterday I made a video. It would not transfer onto my iMovie, which I would then edit from and pass it on to YouTube. So I'm going to try this right from the YouTube uh, recorded video, and then this isn't live and then I will try to transfer it this way. So I showed yesterday how to photograph flat lays and I had another part that showed on my mannequins. Well, that that's on my videos, but I can't get it onto YouTube. So now I've photographed everything. So I will show you a little bit of how I photograph shoes because I have shoes uh, left photograph. So if I can get this turned around and uh, so that you can see the table, I have my table set up, uh, my flat lay table that uh, you can see here. This phone is on a tripod so it's not easy. Uh, I have a table in front of my uh, backdrop and I'm going to photograph shoes on the table so it's easier for me to, uh, to see. So if I can get this adjusted so that you can, so we can see this without me dropping the phone. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh, that should do it. Okay, uh, I got this little um, riser thing. This is actually to put in your cupboard doors, your cupboards, uh, kitchen cupboards to put like spices and things on. And I may end up spray painting this white, and I think it would be better if I spray painted it white. But for now, I use it as is, or I don't use it at, at all. But when I use it, I put it down on this white background. And I'm going to photograph this pair of uh, little heels by Cole Hahn. And I usually take a photograph of them like that first. Then I turn them around so it gets the other side. Of them take a picture like that and maybe a picture picture like that and I I always take a picture of them over the top uh, to show the toes like what you would see if you look down at your shoes and I take a picture of the heels uh, to show that there's no wear on the little heels and uh, this does not have the size inside the shoe the size is on the bottom so I would take a picture of the bottom soles to show the wear these have hardly any wear at all and then I would show the uh, close-up of the uh, bottom where it says uh, Nike Air a sole and the size which is an 8B and that's how I would take a pair of women's shoes and a pair of men's shoes I have here I have a pair of uh, Stacy Adams uh, men's tassel loafers they're in excellent condition uh, before I take, I would take a picture of these, so I would have to take, I don't know, see if the, the price that I paid for them, or I paid half of that, is on the bottom here. And we don't want that to uh, be photographed for sure. So I have to take these downstairs and get this off uh, with either alcohol or uh, something, whatever. I can get it off with. It's very hard because I think that's a magic marker uh, pen in red. So 
I would do this similar thing uh, with these shoes. I would put them on this riser and take a picture of them like that and turn them around. The same type of thing. And for sure, I would take a picture of the heel wear. These are almost like new. And the sole wear. And the size 12 is on there. You take a picture of the inside where the where the uh, brand name is. And also in there uh, is the size and the style and everything. So that is how I take pictures of shoes all on this white background because uh, eBay likes you to have a totally white background. So I'm going to try to uh, uh, now record, uh, let's stop this video and then transfer it onto uh, YouTube and we'll see what happens. So if you see it, I was successful. If not, it's just, it just won't go. Uh, yesterday I did a video uh, that did transfer to iMovie of me measuring things. So if, it, if I can get that one onto YouTube, uh, I'll, also, I'll also put that one on YouTube. So this is bye for now.